Hello, I'm Richard Patterson and welcome to this film presented by IPC Owen and we're going to look at the digital Coulomb meter. Uh, the Coulomb meter measures charge and uh, this device has got a maximum range of 2000 nano coulombs. That's nano is 10 to the minus 9 coulombs. So it's a very small amount of, of, of charge. But uh, in the calculation we'll do a little later, we'll, we'll, we'll just show you how many uh, negative electrons uh, that the meter will measure. So if we look at the construction of the meter, it's the same as our other meters. It's got a robust ABS plastic case. It's got a PP3 9 volt battery inside and it's tamper proof. You have to use a, a screwdriver, four screws to, to change the battery over there. It's got a negative and positive port uh, as in the other meters, but this is a little unusual in that the positive port has got a large metal plate attached to it which is going to be used to um, detect the charge. And we always have a lead, we call it a flying lead, connected to the negative port there on hand to discharge the meter. That's just by touching it on it there, which we'll show you how to do later on. So I'll switch it on again and we'll try and charge up something. So we've got a metal screwdriver here and a, and a cloth. We'll rub it there and see if we can charge up the metal screwdriver. And as you probably know, it's not going to be successful at all. Metal is a conductor and the electrons will, any electrons we, we, we transfer there will soon be transferred down to, back to the, the metal. And if we approach the metal charge there again, it's no matter how much we rub it. But if we now repeat that using a balloon, you can see this balloon has already got a bit of residual charge on it there. If we rub the balloon vigorously there and just bring it up with, with one centimetre of the charging plate there, we can see it's going up. The display is now 40, but that's not the actual reading to do the, to take the reading, we need to discharge the plate, remove the balloon, and we're measuring there nine nano coulombs of charge have been transferred to the metal plate there. Um, in a similar way to we, we, we use a old gold leaf electroscope to, uh, to measure charge. But here we can actually got, got a, um, a quantitative out, a reading, the number, of, the number of nano coulombs. And in this graphic here, we can see how we can calculate how many electrons have been transferred uh, to the Coulomb meter uh, using this calculation. As ever on the, uh, the website, we've got the full range of uh, experiments and instructions, and you can access those by just looking at this QR code. We've also added uh, some teaching instructions from the Institute of Physics Spark website uh, where you can see a range of experiments to do with electrostatics and uh, the digital cooler meter can be used there. So thank you for watching the video. 